Hello all, it's Christophe and in this present video I, I would like to compare the 330 degree functionality uh, between uh, two or three tools, between Adobe Captivate and Articulate Storyline uh, which uh, just introduced the uh, functionality in this uh, beta version and Adobe Captivate has this functionality since uh, uh, three years uh, three years ago. So in this uh, quick video I prepare a quick uh, a test project uh, with uh, several media, uh, several pictures like this and hotspot, uh, hotspot contents. Um, for the Captivate one I introduce uh, also a video with a small uh, hotspot uh, too and a part with uh, a quiz uh, the runner has to to answer to uh, a question so uh, let's go um, in this uh, in this project i would like just to publish when the first uh, first step uh, when you you would like to publish you you can have a, a preview on peripheric for example uh, if you have a, a smartphone but here I will only uh, publish, export my project uh, in uh, HTML5 uh, HTML sorry, uh, format and I, I click on publication. Yes, I would like to, to see my publication. It's here. So let's go. I, I am in a uh, environment uh, like a laboratory, laboratory, and here I can go through visit I am just visit I am totally free to go here 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 I have only one uh, hotspot here when I will, will click here I will go to the uh, next slide so when I am in my captivate uh, I just uh, have um, a hotspot like this so it is here and I can uh, set up your action in probability and action and reason uh, when you click you go to the next slide so here we go up and now I am in a, a picture I shoot uh, my own uh, my garden so uh, I have uh, uh, here a hotspot and I have uh, set up the, the slide to uh, to have uh, something to be uh, guide. guide so when I click here, I go to a next hotspot directly. I, I am not uh, free to, to go and I will test. I click here, I have uh, a quick message, I have a bonne visite. And next, the project give me to this part and I have only to click here to go to the next, to the next slide. I will only uh, pause the project to show you in my Captivate project how it is uh, configured. I have here the um, first hotspot. I will add my film strip and my timeline here just to, to show you. I have the first hotspot here and after the second one. And the second one, I only uh, add um, image. It is a totally transparent image. Uh, it's it's good when you you would like to do, to do some gamification uh, to search in a in an image like this uh, something to for the run. It is very very uh, brilliant, I think. And the next and three the next slide. It is a video um, three sec. 60 video, uh, 360 degree video, and it is uh, very funny. So let's go. Hey, up, I have a, a break in my video. I have to click here. I click in. I have a quick make it message. In here we go. Take care. You you click here and the video will continue. And I am totally free to, to discover all the uh, environment. And after up, a break, and when I click on the break, I have uh, an image. It is like me, wow, like a rabbit. And I click on the um, 
the cross and after I have a, another spot to leave the video so uh, I will go through my captivate and just to show you in the timeline how all the, um, the hotspots are configured I have the first one here in my video with the text uh, the text is, is set up in, in field here and I have to click and after the second one and after the third with uh, an action to go to the next slide uh, this uh, hotspot is only to show an image you know uh, official image so now I can click here and now I am in a new a new picture, no environment, uh, 360 degree environment too. All the pictures are from Adobe Stock uh, library. I have an avatar, so, and here uh, a question mark. So, I have a question, I can answer to a question, to the question, click on, on submit here, and I have the feedback there, it is very practical. And here I only uh, add a hotspot uh, to, to add the, um, the instruction for the run. So just uh, to, to finalize this project, I have the result of the quiz. Uh, is it possible to, to mark the quiz in this uh, kind of project? And that's all for the Captivate uh, presentation. Uh, I think it is very complete. Uh, the possibility to have image and video and to, to have some interactive components in a 360 degree video, I think it is very brilliant, very smart, and uh, it's just difficult to, to cap, to record the components. Uh, like you see, I am with my own smartphone, uh, take some pictures. It's not very quality, but it's working. But I think with a, a good um, material it will be better like uh, this kind of pictures for example or, where you, you have something very very cool so let's now go to articulate storyline uh, and here in this uh, in this software I had uh, I try to, to do the similar project um, so here I have had my um, my picture from Adobe Stock. Uh, in this way, it is uh, the first time I use uh, this functionality of Articulate Storyline. Uh, I think it is very easy uh, when you you have some experience with this um, this software, and if you have some experience with Adobe Captivate too, uh, you have in this uh, this place of the software uh, the possibility to add. Uh, 360 degree image. Uh, you can click here and double click. And after, uh, in order to to add interactivity, you have to click on modify image. And after, you have some uh, marker or click zone uh, in order to to add interactivity. Uh, the logical, uh, I think, in my my way, the logical is. Uh, very similar between Captivate and Storyline uh, for this part uh, of functionality. Um, maybe um, you you can uh, you can see uh, you have two type of navigation: navigation free navigation or guide navigation. Um, so in this uh, first slide, uh, the runner is totally free to click here and to have uh, some information like step one and after you you can um, uh, configure it, set up some trigger uh, in order to go through the, the project for example. So I will show you the publication project um, in between Captivate and Storyline uh, you have uh, the publication possibility um, not for smartphone. Here it is only web uh, possibility. Mm.
So the project is published. Congratulations. Thank you, Articulate. Uh, I will uh, launch my project. So first, um, first thing I see when I open the project, I have two elements. Uh, the number of elements to, to click are significant. So if I click here, I have my text box who display and after I can click on the second spot to go through my project. Here I have my first spot, my first hotspot and it is guide uh, navigation, one visit and after I will go to the next. So I only uh, maybe go to quickly um, I will go back to my the last the previous slide. So here in this previous slide, I have an hotspot very um, uh, hide in my pictures. When I click on this, I have a, um, an avatar uh, and I add a, a question in my environment. But it is very funny because my my avatar and the, all the smart shape are fly. <laughs> and, it is very very funny. Uh, why it is um, like this? Because um, in this uh, in this project, I I just uh, add a smart shape here with um, uh, my my avatar with uh, with add, and after I have my. 360 degree pictures in the background and after I add some smart shape and uh, a question, uh, a free question from storyline. So this is, this is the reason why my, my avatar is fly away. So I can maybe uh, select the second answer maybe and I can click on this. It is correct. So. Uh, thank you Storyline, thank you Captivate for adding this uh, functionality. Uh, enjoy your, um, your practice uh, uh, and your, uh, your application and your, your project. I hope this video was, uh, was very interesting and do not hesitate to add some comments. Bye bye.